John Fiore, are you following me? <laughs> it's sunset time at the river. John, you should be here for this. Cheryl said hi. I don't know if you heard her or not. Hi, Jean. Hi, Ellen. I know you are, John. You keep threatening to come down here. I think we're just going to have to come up there. <clears throat> Thank you, Jean. Yes, it is a very beautiful place here. This is the St. John's River in Crescent City. Hey, Tina. Tina's on. Uh, we are in Central Florida. It's called Crescent City, and it's what you're seeing the, across the St. Johns River is the Ocala National Forest over on the other side where the sun is getting ready to set. And we've got some big dark clouds that are threatening to cover it up, so I wanted to grab this live before that happened. I wish you would, Tina. I wish you were here with us. One of these days, I'm going to drag you up here. <laughs> you see a green orb, John? Um, I'm not seeing it. Oh, you're in Altamont. Awesome. I love Altamont. <laughs> that would be Angel, and I think she's been in the river before, John. Yeah, <laughs> but I don't think she's—I um, <clears throat> don't think she's wanting to go in there tonight. Angel, come here. Angel, come here, baby. Come say hi. Can you come say hi? Come on, baby cakes. Come here. This is Angel. Can you say hi? Say hi. And that's Brookie over there. The river dogs. <laughs> and that's Cheryl Ann over there. <laughs> yes, this is one of my zen spots here at the river. Oh, there's Angel on the deck. She's such a loving dog. Okay, so you don't see the green orb anymore. Uh, yes, Eileen, they do fishing tournaments out here in the river. And obviously, Gerald Ann has a good spot for the fish to come in because a lot of the boats like to come in here. Hi, Bill Bishop. Just sharing the beautiful sunset tonight from the river here in Central Florida. Now we're starting to see some color. This is what I love after the sun does go down behind the tree line. Then the river turns all kinds of colors. It has lots of reds and yellows. Hi, Patty. I've probably taken a million pictures out here on this river. The sunsets and the trees, the eagles and the ospreys. It's an amazing place. 
Oh, and of course the alligators. Can't forget them. What? What you come to tell me? Angel. Hi, baby. Scoop some shrimp. That's Cheryl Ann's job, and she does it very well. And she keeps it stocked, so when I come up, I get shrimp. So, John, you'll just have to take us up on that invitation and come have some shrimp with us. See if I can get the birds flying overhead. Oh, I was trying. I don't know where they went now. In the river. <laughs> uh, yeah, in the river. <laughs> Oh, Patty, it is. This is really a, a nice, uh, chill place for anybody that wants to just get away from the hectic environment of the city or all the traffic and cars. People here drive golf carts. <laughs> and everybody knows everybody. This is where everybody knows your name. <clears throat> Yes, Marlene, thank you for tuning in. There's a couple of ospreys that are very active right now. They have a nest going in the tree right beside of me. I caught one of them in flight this morning and got some good pictures of it. So I thought I would share this little bit of serenity. The more we can put positive, loving energy out there in the world, then the more we can all relax into that. Yeah, Patty, I wish you were here. I wish you could come up this way and just see all of this beauty. Let's see if I can switch it over and show you some of the, the trees that are here. This is a swamp area right there at the end of the concrete. And then on down from there are more trees and that's where the, the eagles and the osprey usually go into to make their nests. And then on the other side, the river, as you can see, goes far, far, far up, up that way. That is south and the river flows north. One of the, is it one of the only rivers, Chairland, that flows north? The Nile flows north. I think there's only maybe three on the planet, three or four at the most. Yeah, so it's one of the first, one of the only ones, just a handful of them that flow that direction. And no, John, it is not cold. <clears throat> uh, Marlene, we're in central Florida. We are outside of DeLand close to uh, Jacksonville. We're smack dab between Jacksonville and Orlando. If you drew a line between them, we'd be right in the middle. Okay, I hope you got that. <laughs> between St. Augustine and Daytona. Between St. Augustine and Daytona. It's a little piece of heaven here on the St. John's River. Hi, Evelyn Crespo. Oh, Patty said it's cold. Well, let me just go check. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, Geraldine is going to check the temperature, so we will know soon. There's a spider web at the bottom. Oh, yeah. And there's spiders. She's going in the river, folks. <laughs> we may have to go in and rescue her. <laughs> okay. No, it's not ice cold. It's not ice cold, she says. 
it's nice. I'd go in it easy. Yeah. Okay. You get in there and swim with those gators. Yeah. There's also manatees up this way. No gators right um, now around. No, I haven't seen any gators today. I saw one, was it yesterday? Hi, everybody. <laughs> Come to the river. Oh, show on the banana trees. Ah, okay. Let's switch around. Actually, I can just, whoops. Sorry about that. Put my finger over the camera. There I am. And behind me are banana trees. This is the outside. That's how I make my banana bread. Mm -hmm. The gongs. And back to the sunset, an angel. John says it's a great place for a mozzarella convention. I'm, I'm, I'm all in. John, I brought mozzarella to the river with me. I don't know if there's any left in the refrigerator. I left Geraldine alone with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, Patty. You too, honey. And thank you for jumping on the live. Oh, look at this. Now it's turning really beautiful with the cloud in the middle of the sun. This is when all the colors start to come out. Hi, Jordana. Uh -huh. He wants to know if it was that cheap supermarket stuff, Geraldine. Oh, no, no, no. Not for our girl. Only the best for me. I'm beginning to think he doesn't love us. John says homemade only. All right, now we're starting to see some oranges, a little bit of red. Oh, he wants to know where I bought it from. I think I got it at Whole Foods, maybe Trader Joe's. I'm not sure where. Ooh, can you all see that sky up ahead? The feathery clouds. Looks like the angels are up there playing. Hi, Luann. Thank you. Yes, I'm here at the river, and I thought I would share some of this beauty tonight with the sunset. I knew it was going to be gorgeous when it started going down a little while ago. And then this big black cloud decided it was going to come along, but it's, it's holding off until we get some of that beautiful, colorful sky opening up. John, you know you can bring your wife any time. Yeah. That is not an excuse there, buddy. Wow, it got so quiet. <laughs> it's like all the birds just stopped. Everything stopped. The boats. We're taking a moment of silence. Let's breathe it in. Yes, it does, Luann. A beautiful breeze that just kicked up. You all see me post pictures of the ospreys when they sit out on the branch. I'll show you where that branch is. It's right 
there sticking out from that tree and they come and sit on that dead branch that's sticking out. It almost looks like a bird with its wings spread and that's where they sit and they just scope out any fish that they can fly down into, dive in the water and fish. I've watched them the last two days as they go fishing and carry that fish up to the nest. How warm is it? Mm, 70s? It's, yeah, it's, no, it got up into the 80s today. Now it's probably around 78, 79, but it was up into the 70s. So come, I actually cook and serve you dinner by the river. I mean, it just doesn't get any better than this. It really doesn't. It'd be better if we had mozzarella, though, homemade. That would have been really good with that tuna tonight. Yes, it would have been. Are we making you feel bad yet, John? <laughs> Well, you know what to do. You can come down and be with us. You have an open invitation at the river. Yeah, it is, Eileen. Where are you at? John, you're so funny. It'll have to do until you get down here and make me some. Oh, you're welcome, Eileen. I hope you have a wonderful night. I hope this gave you a moment of peace and serenity. I hear one of the birds now. It sounds like the osprey. They wake me up in the morning. That's my, my alarm clock. Oh, we'll find it, John. Don't you worry about that. We'll do the research. And then when we get it all ready, then you have no excuse. So glad this was a beautiful sunset tonight. John, you keep making promises. See, if you were here, John, you'd be sitting right here in this spot watching that beautiful sunset. Sitting on the dock of the bay, on the dock of the river. <laughs> Oh, you did? Was it a good card? I think that ball is almost gone. I can see it through the trees now.
Good night, Luann. I'm going to get off of here as well and wish all of you a beautiful, peaceful rest of your night. And I hope you enjoyed this moment of peace here at the river with me. We can virtually get together, even though there's a lot going on that keeps us separated at the moment. We can all join in and just share something like this together. I encourage you to do that in your world as well. Thank you for being here. Much love going out to every one of you. Bye now.